Uh, my name is Ulf Meyer. I come from Berlin, Germany, and my background is in architecture. Uh, however, I spent my time working as an architectural writer, author or critic you may also call it, and also as an educator. So uh, this is the fourth Eco Week that uh, I attend after Israel, Poland and Italy. And it's fair to say I'm very impressed uh, with how things are going so far. In terms of organization and maybe student ambition, this is the best Eco Week I've attended so far. Our group, uh, which is made up of 10 students and myself, works on the so-called Karen's House, which was once a little kiosk for a hospital in northern Copenhagen. And it's roughly 100 years old and the thermal qualities of this building are just horrible. It's a total energy drain, uh, the insulation is very poor, so it's not only a waste of energy but frankly also a big waste of money. Uh, 20,000 crowns uh, is the price they have to pay every year for their energy bill for a tiny little house. So it doesn't make great ecologic or economic sense to keep it that way. So our task really was only to improve the thermal performance. We, we did it and we did something else on top also. Some of my students decided to push the envelope a little bit and suggest different ways to extend the building also into the beautiful surrounding garden. I'm surprised that in comparison to other students that I've uh, taught before, the Danish students in particular seem to be quite tech savvy. They seem to know their construction detailing, for example, surprisingly well. They understand thermal insulation, this being Denmark. Uh, of course, it makes great sense to know these things also. Uh, I was a professor in the United States of America for three years and there, frankly, students had no clue about uh, thermal insulation even existing, frankly. So this is pleasantly different in Denmark. So I think the strength probably is in the technical construction realm, no surprise there. Maybe in terms of artistic expression, model making for example, uh, and architectural design, for some of them it's the first time to really step into that realm. So it's very exciting for them and thus very exciting for me also. I think Eco Week makes great sense, the attendance seems to prove that. Uh, uh, somebody last night called it a step out of the comfort zone for many students, maybe for Kia as an institution also. Uh, I asked somebody and they told me this was the first time that Kia decided to do such a theme uh, week and I hope it won't be the last one. I think it's, it makes great sense.